It's a bold statement. A group of UNM students started their own anti-DWI campaign targeting their classmates. They're also giving away free keychain breathalyzers to people to get people thinking twice. News 13's Marissa Lucetto is live downtown with the story. Marissa. Jess, the group's goal is to give away 25,000 breathalyzers, but the students and police have a warning for everyone who takes one. We have firsthand experience with people getting in their cars after being out at the bar. And that's really unacceptable. Kyle Lactasic and <laughs> Kyle Gwynn, two UNM seniors, fighting. say they know what it takes to grab their peers' attention. These aggressive branding techniques are starting to work. And their campaign will definitely grab your attention. It's called Expletive DWI. Know your limit. That was a campaign slogan we came up with really to emphasize our opinion about driving under the influence. Lactasic says their friend had a run-in with a drunk driver. Our other co-founder, Tomash, was actually hit by a drunk driver at the intersection of Cole and Stanford. So this month, the three created a website, an anti-DWI campaign of their own. If they're out there trying to spread the word, don't drink and drive, then by all means, uh, we support it 100 percent. They're also giving away free keychain breathalyzers to anyone who wants one. But State Police Sergeant Curtis Ward says people shouldn't use them as an excuse to drive drunk. So I don't want somebody who blows into this thing under the legal limit putting themselves in a position where they think they're good to go and then somebody like me stops them and they end up in handcuffs and again them telling me they took a PBT test on their own and they were below the legal limit is not their free pass out of jail. That's why the group says they have a disclaimer on their website. They're not a marking point for um, being okay. Zero is the limit. And the campaign is there to help reinforce that message. It's strictly a reminder, you know, this is an awareness campaign. Now, the students are funding this campaign right now on their own, and they're hoping if it takes off, they'll get some sponsors down the road. We have links to their campaign on careqe.com. Back to you, Jess. All right, thank you, Marissa. New Mexico State Police say breathalyzers that officers use are certified through the state health department. They're also tested regularly.